Profitability is a very good thing. It's actually the oxygen to your business. Without profit, okay, you have no business. Just like without oxygen, you can't breathe. Without pro- uh, without profit, you can't grow and you can't operate your business, okay? And that's gonna serve no one. So your job as the entrepreneur is to increase your profitability. It's also to focus on your client experience intensely. In fact, taking a step back, speaking of profitability, you should never be an expense or a cost to your owner. You should be an investment that retains and produces more clients and more profitability. Otherwise, and I say this with absolute love, you should be terminated and rightfully so. Welcome to the Fitness CEO Podcast, a show dedicated to helping fitness entrepreneurs launch and grow successful gyms. Here's your host, Bryce Henson. So an entrepreneur, wait for it, is a teammate with an entrepreneur's mindset. That's really what an entrepreneur is, is a teammate we just talked about with that entrepreneur's mindset. We combine the two. This is what an entrepreneur is and this is what we're after. So meaning an entrepreneur takes massive action in a very active approach and growing the business's profitability, okay, not just training time for dollars. Now I wanna take a step back here and I'm gonna rant for a second and really kind of showcase the value of profit, uh, profitability. And for whatever reason, uh, you know, throughout our culture recently, I feel like profitability has a bad connotation. My friends, this could not be further from the truth. Uh, Our country is the wealthiest country in the history of the world, which we're very grateful for. We have a lot of problems just like any other country does, but we are founded on free market capitalism. And profitability is the name of the game. Profitability, all it is, is efficiency. What it means is you're producing more to your clients than you consume. And that's an efficient business. If you're actually taking more from your clients than you produce, that's inefficient. Therefore, you're not profitable and you should be out of business. So profitability is a very good thing. It's actually the oxygen to your business. Without profit, okay, you have no business. Just like without oxygen, you can't breathe. Without pro- uh, without profit, you can't grow and you can't operate your business, okay? And that's gonna serve no one. So your job as the entrepreneur is to increase your profitability. It's also to focus on your client experience intensely. In fact, taking a step back, speaking of profitability, you should never be an expense or a cost to your owner. You should be an investment that retains and produces more clients and more profitability. Otherwise, and I say this with absolute love, you should be terminated and rightfully so. If you're watching this training, I know you have passion, you have ambition, and you wanna be an awesome entrepreneur that adds value and profitability to business, which is a good thing. Additionally, speaking of profitability and finances, I'm gonna uh, shed some light on a very common but incorrect belief. And the common but incorrect belief is, my friend, your employer or your entrepreneur does not pay you. They only manage the money. Your clients pay you. And that's really, really important for you to understand because if you have more clients, then guess what? Your employer, your entrepreneur can pay you more. The opposite is also true. So speaking of money and finances, you might be asking yourself then, how does the business make more money, Bryce? And in this particular space, in the Fit Body Bootcamp, in the gym training space, in the personal um, growth and per- group personal training space, relationships is the secret sauce. If you make yourself so valuable to your owner by developing strong relationships, again, relationships are the currency of business in this particular business model, your clients are gonna stay, pay, refer, which means more money's coming in, which then means more money for the business and also more money for you. So if your business is going to survive, everyone, including yourself, needs to be an entrepreneur. Hey, my friend, hopefully you love that short teaser of the recent episode on the Fitness CEO podcast. Uh, to check out the full episode, it will be dropping shortly. But in the meantime, there's some other episodes around here that you need to see.